So it's, it's, it's unimaginably small. So we can just about conceive of, of the size of a, a living cell. And then where, where does our picture of the universe start to break down? Of course, the things we can really get a feel for are things that are around, let's say, a few inches, a few centimeters to a few meters, or maybe if you're a runner, you get a sense of what a few miles means. But I think it's quite difficult to even picture, I suppose 100 miles you can picture because you can take a train ride, or, or a few thousand miles you can picture because you can get on an aircraft and fly across the Atlantic. So we have a kind of a picture of that. But when you get much bigger than that, we don't experience those distances anymore. So, so I would say that when, you, when we start to talk about distances that are much larger than distances that we might travel on the surface of the Earth, then I think our feel for those distances begins to break down. Maybe you, you, if you spoke to, 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 to Buzz Aldrin, then he would have a feel for the distance a quarter of a million miles because he's flown it right, right to the moon.